Honda Civic back in for more audio upgrades. After our vehicle check-in, the next step is to wrap the vehicle in protective tape. This protective tape helps keep the vehicle safe so we can do our installation. We previously installed a subwoofer system into this Honda, but the rear deck was definitely giving some rattles. So the beginning of our installation is going to be installing a Hushmet sound damping to the rear deck and rear deck panels to help prevent that rattling. One of the requests from our client was to keep weight to a minimal. So instead of doing the entire inner and outer door skin with sound damping like we typically do with audio installations, we are going to focus the sound treatment just to the speaker mounting location and right behind it. The speaker wires soldered to the terminals with heat shrink and a quick disconnect plug. A foam ring installed around the speaker to seal that speaker to the door panel so all of our music goes right through the door grill and does not get lost in the door. One area that's typically overlooked when doing sound damping to door panels to eliminate rattles are the door panel clips. These clips are actually loose inside the majority of door panels and they will create kind of a clicking, rattling noise uh, when the speakers are playing. So we take our cloth tape and we wrap it around the head of the door panel clip so that way when we reinstall this clip back into the door panel mount, it has a nice cushion between the clip and the door panel mount and we don't have any rattling that comes from that. Here, we are applying the Hushmat ultrasound damping to the reverse side of the door panel. This helps greatly reduce panel distortion and any rattling that may come from the vibrations of that plastic when the speaker is playing music.
hush mat silencer megabond was installed to the top of the door panel. This helped prevent the rattling that was occurring from the door lock cables and from some of the flat points of the plastic panel where it actually made contact with the metal on the door. For the power wire fuse holder, we fabricated a mounting bracket that is secured down by the battery mount. This allows for easy servicing of the fuse holder and the battery. What's with this funky shape? Well, a goal for this client was to keep everything installed into the spare tire foam tray. So we had to do a multiple layer rack in order to achieve that. So on the first level, we have the installation of the distribution blocks and the load resistors. Then you'll see to the left of that, we mounted the capacitor, and then there will be the second layer of the rack, which will hold the six channel DSP amplifier. 